Hello, my name is Kaida Moyum Sangaza, the co-founder of Bespoke Delights. I have a passion in skincare, and this comes from me having skin conditions such as eczema. My name is Leon Damba. I run a company called The Sous Chef. I love food, so I wanted to provide healthier options to, to, to the clients the same thing that I would want to eat. I just wanted to share with the world. I just come back from Australia for my studies and when I came back home I found that there was a lack in natural skincare and beauty products and those are things that I actually needed for my own skin and because of that I actually saw a gap in the market and because I have a biomedical science background I decided let me actually start using it and help benefit a lot of families with what I have. There's certain uh, standards which I've seen throughout my travels, which I saw that they are missing in the Zim. So my idea and plan is to bridge that gap between Zimbabwe and the global village. What gave me the, the courage to go for this is that I actually really want my business to grow and I want my brand to be an international brand that a lot of families can recognize and trust in. And because of that, I realized this competition can help me if I win the prize. My hope is that this business will actually uh, grow beyond what it is in terms of capacity, its branding, and its distribution networks. And something that, as Zimbabwe, you know, we'll all be very proud of it. Frankly speaking, um, sometimes when you do training, um, it's, it's, it's more of a generic training. It's not centered on you. It's just how to be an entrepreneur and how to things to do, A, B, C, D. But people don't really teach you how to be an entrepreneur in your own business. So that's the interesting part about this. They are zooming in into your business and concentrating on what you do. And as much as um, the money is there, or fish, that's the dream, um, I'm, 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 I'm trying to get away with all the education which I can get. Uh, all the training and everything, it's enlightening and education has gone up so I don't see myself paying for my MBA anytime soon after this training so I think I'm covered for that one now. <laughs>